hello everybody welcome back to my channel and welcome to my new video in this video today i'm gonna show you best setting for lime 3ds emulator on your pc so let's get started as you can see on my computer screen i have a lime 3ds version 2109 and if you have older version then please update it first so and for more settings we need to go to emulation and configuration first so first of all guys we need to uh, select emulation speed 100% or you, you, you can increase your emulation speed from here like this so but I recommend 100% by default and then go to system and enable a uh, new TDS mod and it's done go to graphics tab first but first cool audio settings so emulation you need to select HLE first from here do not select an other option like multi-core or LLE accurate so but I I need to select this one first and enable audio stretching you need to disable it okay and uh, it's done now to graphics tab and uh, we need to select resolution mm, yep yeah. auto window size if you have uh, a native resolution like uh, 2x uh, or tx or 4, 4x like uh, i show you my native resolution right click and go to display settings and uh, scroll down and you can see display resolution this is my native resolution 1024 by 768 so i can choose this one or this one so but i recommend this one native and if you want to increase your resolution then you can uh, face a lot of issues like lagging uh, if you select these options so but i recommend this one so go to advanced tab and select graphics api if you have amd gpu or intel HD graphics then you can select vulkan because vulkan is better than OpenGL uh, for performance so I select Vulkan if you want to use Vulkan and uh, uh, sometimes Vulkan does not show over here then you need to update drivers for your GPU device first uh, so I show you my already installed the drivers for my GPU device so I go to search bar on Windows and type here device manager device manager go to device manager control panel it's very important thing guys if you want to get more performance so you need to check already installed drivers so go to properties and drivers you can see driver date and driver version already installed 2024 so I'm making this video in 2024 if you have older version then please update drivers first it's very important thing guys so I cancel it and select your GPU device if you have multiple GPU devices then you need to select more powerful GPU device from here but I have only one GPU device so this is why uh, selected by default already and enable this one hardware shaders and uncheck this option enable vSync and okay it's done pause it and for more settings uh, right click go to uh, display settings and uh, scroll down go to graphic settings and select your uh, application file you need to delete your old application so my application line uh, 3ds over here on my desktop right click and open file location and select this application file add option options high performance and save and more settings go to a media control panel uh, we need to change some settings from a media control panel 
guru manage CD settings but first go to adjust image settings and select performance from here like this check this option apply and go to manage 3d settings click here and uh, scroll down power management mode maximum performance and texture filtering quality high performance and vertical sync should be off already off and yeah it's done and it's done now guys you can play your games in line 3d apps emulator with maximum more performance so i hope this tutorial will be helpful for you guys if you like then please subscribe to the channel and like my this video thanks for watching